Oops, yes, there we go. By the by, the title is Parsen. Wait, in a dish. Wait a minute. It's this, yes. Yes, the beautiful house of God. People were talking, where, what is King Solomon doing? He is building a house of God. It will be a beautiful temple. Hiram, king of Tar, was a friend of David. Give me a best word to build the house of God. Solomon asked Hiram for the best wood for the temple. King Hiram gave Solomon the best wood. King Solomon gave King Hiram food for the people of Terah. King Solomon sent 30,000 people to King Hiram to bring wood. Solomon had 80,000 stone cutter. And Solomon has 70,000 carrier. He had also over 3,000 foremen. The king made them cut the stone to lay the foundation of the temple. Many people trimmed the stones to build a temple. Some people work with gold and silver. They call in the inside. They made many things. He the old temple. Some people work with gold. It took us seven years for King Solomon to finish the temple. The temple was big and beautiful. King Solomon gathered all the leaders of Israel. All the holy things were put in the temple. They worshipped God. When they finished the worship, the temple was filled with God cloud. The temple was filled with God's glory. King Solomon gathered all the people of Israel. They praised God in the new temple. King Solomon prayed to God with the friend of people. We praise you. Please stay with us. Please help us love you. The Israel were happy because of grace of God. The chapter, on the next chapter is God with Elijah. Elijah told King Ahab, God will punish the disobeyed king. Air will be not rain for many years. King Ahab didn't want to hear Elijah. The King Ahab was his wife Je Jezebel tried to kill Elijah. Elijah had to run away. Elijah conveyed God's word to the king. God told him to escape from the king. Where shall I go? asked Elijah. High in Carrot Rebrain, east of the Jordan, and drink from it. God let him. What can I eat to live? asked Elijah. There was nothing to eat at the garbage oven. God sent food to 
only child every day. God sent Marvin with food, Marvin's brought the bread and meat every day. Alita drank from the stream. God gave Elijah good food every day. Elijah prayed, Thank you, God, for the food. God, next chapter is Elijah had a family. It didn't rain for a long time. The carrots were being dry up. The people didn't have enough food. The crop didn't grow well. Where shall I get food to eat? Said Elijah. Go to Jarephath to widow who will talk, take care of you there. Elijah went to a Jarephath. When Elijah went into town gate, a widow was gathering sticks. Elijah said to her, Can I have some water and bread? The man said, My son and I only have enough for our and all to last meal. Elijah replied, Don't worry, prepare food, bring the bread to me first, then cook something for you and your son. God will not let you go hungry until it rains. The flour and oil will never run out. The woman did Elijah say. Elijah, the woman, and the, her son had enough to eat. After that, God took care of the woman and the son to Elijah. Woman thanked Elijah for giving her enough food. Elijah thanked the woman for giving food too. Yes, they will read the Bible for good. Fun and fun. Yes, I'm enjoying. Let's see you next time. Bye. Next time we will read a room for Elisha. Yes, see you next time. Bye. See you next time.